How to Eat a Sweet Persimmons Persimmons, also called Sharon fruit, mature late in fall and can stay on trees until winter. This sweet, slightly tangy fruit has two main varieties, astringent and non-astringent, and the variety affects how ripe the fruit needs to be before you can eat it. We'll teach you how to eat a persimmon and give you ideas on how to include this fruit in other meals, as well as how to identify whether a persimmon is ripe. Number 1. Confirm the persimmon is sweet and non-astringent. Sweet persimmons are typically tomato-shaped and often sold under the name Fuyu in the West. If your persimmon does not match this description, you won't enjoy it if you follow these instructions with the wrong type of persimmon. Number 2. Check whether the persimmon is ripe. You can tell a persimmon is ripe when it's firm and orange or deep orange red. Sweet persimmons taste best when they're crisp. A yellow persimmon is edible, but not fully ripe. Do not eat an unripe green persimmon. Green persimmons will always taste astringent, whether they're of the sweet variety or astringent variety. You can eat persimmons overripe as well, with a spoon. Number 3. Wash the persimmon. Rub the persimmon clean under running water. The peel is edible, so wash it thoroughly. Number 4. Cut off the leaves and slice. Using a sharp knife, cut off the leaf-like flower and stem. Slice the persimmon into thin wedges or slices, as you would a tomato. The skin is edible and usually thin. If you prefer to peel it, briefly immerse the whole fruit in hot water. Remove with tongs, then peel. This is the same process as blanching tomatoes. Number 5. Eat the persimmon raw. A sweet persimmon should be firm and crisp, with a sweet flavor. If there are seeds, remove and discard them. Try adding lemon juice or cream and sugar. For more uses, check out the recipes below. Thanks for this watching my videos. Please subscribe, like and share.